the entire physical world just plainly doesn't exist. Idealists believe that the essential nature of reality doesn't lie in the material world around us, but in things like consciousness, ideas, and reason. Many of us subscribe to the belief that there is a physical world that exists completely independently from us, because our senses feed us information about it every second. If a tree falls, but nobody is there to hear it, does it still make a sound? George Barclay may have been the first person to ask that very question. Barclay was an 18th century philosopher who decided to out-philosophize everyone. Barclay subscribed to a philosophical doctrine called idealism. Barclay believed that the things our senses tell us about reality and reality itself are actually the same thing. So if objects are inseparable from their properties, and those properties can only be perceived as sensory experiences in our minds, then there can't be a physical world that exists separately to us, right? If we aren't there to perceive an object, it simply doesn't exist. And so, if a tree falls in a forest, but nobody is there to hear it, then, according to Barclay, no, it doesn't make a sound, because there is no tree. Completely mental, I know.